Howdy nerds! Uh, we have comic books and literature to discuss this time around. Uh, this is actually a short section, a shorter section, I should say. It comes from a much longer video that I like to call the Week in Nerddom. You can find the full video over on the main channel at Generally Nerdy on YouTube or over on Rumble, Generally Nerdy. Uh, you can go check it out there as well. But since we're here, we might as well get to it. This is comic books and literature, all of the written stuff that we have to, that's worth talking about, I guess I should say. Comic books and books is quick. Uh, we have one piece, and that one piece is 20th Century Studios is a new uh, comic book label that is being started by, obviously, Disney, because they own 20th Century at this point. Uh, th this is being created very specifically for the likes of Planet of the Apes, Aliens, and Predator, uh, and then things of the, a similar nature, very likely the more mature, not really Marvel, friendly kind of stuff is going to be going on to 20th Century Studios. Uh, the first book is going to be Planet of the Apes. It's going to be on shelves April 5th, and then from there, there will be more announcements and more announcements, and we will talk about them. Uh, there are currently at least one book for each of those franchises, Planet of the Apes, Aliens, and Predator. They all have books on the roster. The, the Again, the big one is the launch title, and that's Planet of the Apes April 5th. So, so we'll keep you posted that's what we got though so let's get into comics and books suggestions all right so suggestion for this episode is another william gibson book we talked about neuromancer previously we actually talked about mona lisa overdrive again but there's a book that happens in between those two in the sprawl trilogy and that's the book we're talking about today that is count zero Count Zero is, again, the second book of the Sprawl trilogy. It takes place technically seven years after the events of the Neuromancer book, like I said, we've spoken of previously. It's fantastic. Uh, I, I, this, is, this is cyberpunk. This is the world that they are borrowing from when they create things like the Matrix and the cyberpunk video game and the cyberpunk anime and basically any anime that has that same aesthetic. It's coming from the minds of people like William Gibson, Neil Stevenson, these authors that we talk about here. So yeah, definitely worth a read. Absolutely one of the greatest fiction authors of our lifetime, William Gibson's Count Zero. Once again, nerds, that was a short section that comes from a longer video on the main channel, Generally Nerdy, YouTube or Rumble. Take your pick, I'm on both. You can go find it there. You can go find all of the other news there as well including the live episode. We do a live episode roughly once a week, every Friday evening. You can join the conversation live, or you can just leave comments here on this one or any of the other ones you find on the Clips channel. Thank you very much, nerds. We've got other news to discuss in other videos, but while we're getting out of here, don't forget that if it's generally nerdy, it's probably here. <laughs>